Welcome back everyone. You may be experiencing some issues with your Xbox One where for some reason it may not be booting up properly. Maybe you're having some crashes whenever you're booting up any games. Maybe it's freezing. There's a lot of issues that kind of happen in these types of things. So the very first thing I would recommend doing as I always recommend, it's pretty much the easiest thing you can do is to restart your Xbox. So don't do it the normal way. What I would recommend doing here is I would go ahead and try to safely boot down your Xbox if you can, but if it's stuck and if it's frozen, you want to unplug everything from your Xbox One, including but not limited to your con any controllers connected, any keyboards, accessories, gaming, streaming things like AC adapters, Ethernet ports, you want to go ahead and unplug everything from your device. At that point, I would just recommend letting it sit there for like a couple of seconds, maybe like a couple of minutes even. You want to make sure you can go ahead and kind of make, you know, just let it sit there. It'll kind of reset itself. And at that point, what I would recommend doing is going back to your Xbox, plugging back in everything and seeing if that actually ends up fixing it. Sometimes when you go ahead and boot up a game like that, there may be some type of, you know, thing that's installed to your console. It's always sometimes with those game streaming, you know, if you're trying to screen record your gameplay, with a third-party device. I've actually seen this impacting a lot of different devices, so keep that in mind. Now, if that doesn't end up fixing it, what I would recommend doing is before you go ahead and boot back up your specific device, you know, in terms of the game, what I would recommend doing is going into your settings on your specific console, and I would recommend updating your specific console. This is by far another really massive thing you can do. I've seen time and time again that sometimes Microsoft will push out an update, or even sometimes the game may have a glitch inside of it. But when you update your specific console to a more recent version of software, you can actually find out that this may actually end up fixing the issue. So that's pretty much what I would recommend doing in this case, is to fully go ahead and update your specific software on your device. As I mentioned before, this has a higher chance of fixing it than even restarting it in my opinion, but this is pretty much another massive thing you can do that I've seen time and time again to actually go ahead and fix it. Now let's say you find that when you, you know, boot up a specific game, let's say you're trying to boot up like Fortnite or whatever the case is, and let's say you go into another game like Cyberpunk, I don't know, whatever other game, and you notice that all your other games work fine except Fortnite for example, well this probably means that that specific device has an issue, you know, with the specific software it's on. So what does this mean? This essentially means that you may actually have to go ahead and reinstall that specific game. Again, it's not a guarantee, but this is another massive thing that I've seen time and time again to actually end up, you know, fixing some people's things. So what I would recommend doing in this case is to go ahead, delete that specific game, and just go ahead and reinstall it. This may mean that, you know, it doesn't really fix it at all, but like I mentioned before, this has another pretty high chance of actually fixing it at the end of the day. So those are just a couple ways to go ahead and fix your Xbox One. If you're experiencing any issues or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below if it fixed it for you. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section as well hit the like button that would mean so much but definitely hit that subscribe button every single subscriber that we get really does count so it means so much if you guys get hit that also check out the other links down in the description as well my twitter my instagram my other channels more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then